bang every time our next guest shows up. Please welcome science guy, Steve Spangler. Fine. All right, so uh, here's what I was thinking. Uh, a lot of fun things to do at home, all right? Okay. So, so here's some dry ice and t with Halloween just right around the corner. Why not? So here's what you need to do. I just got these cylinders here, and I put some hot water in the cylinders. Okay. And then you don't want to touch the dry no, ice. No, don't ever touch dry no, ice. Because it's like 110 degrees below zero. So this goes in here like this, and then you just put the pellets on. So these are in pellet form. So here's what it looks like. So it bubbles away, and that's pretty fun. Oh, that's right? very so fun. Now, here's what's fun about this mm -hmm. is that See, you can you can have somebody here. You can hang on to it now. All see, right. it's okay. Yep. See, and it's an exfoliant yep. as well. See how that? See? Mm -hmm. Don't waste it. Okay. All, right. No. All right. So now, here, watch this. This is fun, but if you just take a little dish soap and you put the dish soap inside, now the kids have fun. So a little squirt in each one of those, and now they can touch it. See? So now you can just you reach up like this and you can touch, and then the carbon dioxide is trapped inside. See how wow. cool that is? Wow. That's very touch? cool. See, is that? Is, is that fun? Yeah. So what's fun is just to do this at a party and then leave because it just keeps going and going and going. All right, but but here's a bigger container. How long will that go like that? Uh, for like five, ten minutes. I don't know until we ruin the floor, I okay. guess. So all right, so this goes here. Okay. So now watch this. I've got uh, dry ice, and I'm going to put the dry ice into the bigger container here like this. Okay, all right. It's okay. It's all going to go in. Um, so this goes, here. and you want some good bubbling to go on. And in the meantime, if you would just hang on to like the hose. Okay. okay. All right. So here we go. We just need lots of dry ice inside. You want lots and lots of bubbling. All right. Good. Oh, right, this is perfect. All right. All right. So now here's what I have over here is just some soapy solution here like this. So I'm going to put some on the table. And now we're going to use the hose on top. And now you're going to get to touch it. Right, so this goes over the top like this. So you see this, uh, see the fog that comes out. So it's just carbon dioxide and water vapor. So this comes off, and I'm going to dip it into some of the, the, this here. Look at these big bubbles wow. that you can make. That's that kind of cool. cool. So very here, cool. I think we can make a huge one here like this. Watch this. See, it gets big. Oh, great. So you just have hours of fun doing this with the kids over and over and over. Now you can reach out if you want to, and you can touch it. Try to touch it. Watch. Wow. Is that cool? That's very cool. That's, that's, that's fun. That's fun. So they're, they're kind of like these boo bubbles. I think that's what you call. Okay, hold on. I'll give it to you. Very that's just cool. cool. It's awesome. All now, right. does the dry ice ever melt ever? Yeah. So it's cool from a science standpoint because it turns from a solid into a gas. Mm -hmm. So it doesn't really melt. It, it never turns this into a liquid. This will just turn into, into a, a gas. gas. That, yeah. That, okay. Just into a gas. All right. So you're doing this. This is like the appetizer for the party, and you're probably going to serve something as well. Mm -hmm. So step over here, and you can kind of see what happens here. I need you to put these on. So here, I'll do them for you. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Sorry. All right. Is that good? All right. Yes, I because see. Because you always wear your safety glasses before you eat your Pringles. All right. So, so here's our potato chips. And I noticed this: is that if you're eating potato chips, you might get your hands stuck in there, and that would be wrong. Mm -hmm. You know, because it could hurt. So <clears throat> I've got a new way to kind of get the Pringles out. So here's what you do: you just put a hole in the bottom like this. So you just put a little hole in the bottom, and I put a hole in the top. And then you go to your pantry, and you get a tank of hydrogen. All right. And then you just should fill we, up this should balloon. Should we knock that dry ice off so sure. you're not going to hit it? All right, good. Yeah. All right, so now you get your tank of hydrogen, fill up the balloon, and now we're just going to put hydrogen into the can. Right. Okay? So you're just going to do this. And what we're doing is we're purging all the air. We're just letting the hydrogen kind of come out. So it's pretty easy to do. You just get these materials, and then you light it on fire. All right? <laughs> all right. So, so this is great. So you see now, how, you see how it's burning here? I do. So you see that little flame? You're just burning hydrogen gas, mm -hmm. and it's going to burn its way down, and that oxygen's going to come inside. So we've got hydrogen gas and oxygen and hydrogen and oxygen, and pretty soon that flame is going to get low enough that it's going to go just right underneath. Mm -hmm. And as soon as it goes right underneath there, then we get the perfect mixture of hydrogen. And <laughs> see, isn't that a great way to do it? So you just kind of... Really good. Very cool. Very cool. So much easier than dumping them out. Yeah, so here, much I'm easier. I'm going to help you over here by the pumpkin. All right. right. We're going to go over to pumpkin eater. You want me eater. behind it? Yeah, please. Okay. All right, so here's a little pumpkin eater over here. Okay. And he ate a lot of candy for Halloween. Yeah. So um, so we need to help him out a little bit. So here's here's the lid. I'll set it down here. And I'm going to let you hold on to that in just a second. Okay. And then I took, um, you know, mom puts hydrogen peroxide on your skin, you know, if you had a cut or something. So this is hydrogen peroxide. And, and this goes down inside like this. Okay. And now there's a little bit of soap in there as well. So now here's what we're going to do. Um, 
What are those? This is going to be a problem. All right, so you're going to hang on to this, and then you're going to no. Here's what you're going to do. You're going to. I didn't want you to have to do this, but you're going to hang on to this. Okay. Alrighty. Are you okay with that? Yeah, yeah. All right. So now here's the deal. I'm going to pour those in, and then we have to put that on real fast before the explosion. Okay. I mean, um. Okay. So wait. Wait. I want to see. Okay. How, how oh, can no, I do it's okay. It? It's, I'm going to help you. All right. So, all right. I don't. Okay. All right. So you just hold on there, and I'm going to pour this in, and I'm going to go. Ellen, give them to me. Ready? So here we go. I'm going to pour them in. Good. Ellen, give them to me. Good. All right. Huh. So here it is. So here's little pumpkin. Yeah. <laughs> see, he he ate a lot. He had a kind of an upset tummy. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. That's fantastic. Steve, I love all your stuff. If you want to learn more about this, go to our website. Uh, that very, very cool. Thanks, Steve. Thank you. Speed Thanks Steve Spangler. Rich, Rich Springfield will be here after this. <laughs>